We finally got you, Trump! For what? You know what? Yep, yeah, it's all over, buddy. But I didn't even do anything! Exactly! We have breaking news. Twice impeached, no longer President Donald Trump has been arrested for not being on Epstein's client list. We have a developing story. Not my president, Donald Trump, has been arrested for not being on the client list. America is now safe from this monster. President Clinton. Yeah? Can you tell me what this is? Uh, that's my buddy Jeffrey's client list. <gasps> and can you tell me whose name is missing from this list? Uh, yeah. Donald Trump. <gasps> President Clinton. Uh, yeah? Did you ever see Donald Trump at Epstein Island? Nope. Not once. <gasps> you son of a bitch! You gonna fry for this, Trump! We have breaking news! Twice impeached no longer President Trump has been found guilty of not being on Epstein's client list. The DA is pushing for the death penalty. And in other news, all the people on the client list are doing pretty good. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> Sorry about that. How dare you? I, I can't believe you just did that. I'm oh, oh, man, I can't believe it. It was just a yawn. Just, just a yawn? Yeah. Just a yawn? Oh, yeah. 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 What? Breaking news! Twice impeached no longer President Donald Trump viciously assaulted a group of innocent victims in an elevator, causing mass panic and outrage throughout the nation. We have a developing story. The manhunt for the elevator terrorist Donald Trump continues as the world waits in fear. A candlelight visual that's being held for the survivors of this unspeakable crime. This just in. Former not my president Donald Trump attacks a group of innocent people in an elevator just seconds ago. Uh, I, I, I'm declaring a state of emergency. Uh, I, 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 America is just not safe with this maniac on the loose. My team and I will work around the clock until Trump has been captured. The FBI has launched a full investigation yep. into Trump's elevator attack. Yeah, we got every officer in America out there looking for Trump. That's right. And we won't rest nope. until Trump is arrested and charged to the full extent of the law. Life in prison. Uh, until Trump is indicted and given, li <laughs> and given life in prison for this heinous criminal assault. <laughs> Democracy will never be restored. This is a disgrace to America and uh, all mankind. I agree. Trump needs to be in prison for this. Can you describe the attack? Oh, I, I, I've never been so afraid. Um, my whole life flashed before my eyes. And how were you able to get away from Trump? Uh, I, I don't know. I mean, it just all happened so fast. I, I think the only reason I survived is because of my years of street fighting experience. What was going through your mind while Trump was assaulting everyone? <laughs> well, I, I, he, he was definitely on a mission, but I, I, I wasn't scared. I mean, I, as, as soon as he started freaking out on everybody, my corn pop training kicked in, and I took him out. Alexandria. Yeah? How did Trump's elevator assault affect you? Well, technically, I wasn't, like, there or, like, whatever. But if I was totally, like, there, I could have, like, totally almost died. Do you have any advice for the families out there while this manhunt for Trump goes on? Yeah, uh, lock yourselves in your houses, uh, shut down your businesses, take your kids out of school, get vaccinated, and wear a mask so Trump can't see you. We're gonna need at least two weeks to flatten the Trump curve. Brian, yeah? how were you able to survive this attack? Well, I don't remember much. It happened so fast. I passed out, and when I woke up, Trump was saying how sorry he was, but the damage was already done. The doctor says I'm unfixable. Mr. President. Oh, the president's here? <laughs> hey, where's, where's he at? Has Trump been caught yet? Uh, no, no, he hasn't. Uh, but, but we're doing everything we can. I, I don't care how much taxpayer money we got to spend. We're going to find him and we're going <sighs> to... Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Uh. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. We have breaking news. The twice impeached President Donald Trump's son, Donald Jr., viciously assaulted a group of innocent victims in an elevator just seconds ago. Breaking news! Donald Trump's criminal son, Donald Jr., assaults a crowd of people. Investigations are underway as the world waits in fear. Breaking news! President Biden has just declared a state of emergency as the manhunt for Donald Trump Jr. continues. A candlelight vigil will be held tonight in memory of the survivors. It was horrible. Um, I mean, what, what kind of society are we living in when 
You can't let me get into an elevator without being burnt, John. You can tell he was on a mission. He just stood there and burnt. People like that belong in prison. From what I remember, it sounded like a Russian burp. I'm like a survivor, but I almost died. And I think he was staring at my butt. He so wanted to date me. What kind of monster would do something like this? I blame his father. They both belong in prison. This is truly the darkest day in American history. You don't want to know what we went through. Donald Trump Jr.? Yeah? FBI, you're under arrest. Breaking news! Elevator terrorist Donald Trump Jr. has been arrested and charged with assault. The district attorney is pushing for the death penalty. And in other news, Hunter Biden made another amazing video. Way to go, buddy.